up like to the whole wide world? How many light holders do I have in here? Come on, shine your light. <laughs> Everybody shine your light. Shine bright so the whole wide world will know that we are kingdom. Everyone that I meet, I can give a smile. And everywhere I see you need, I go the extra mile, yeah. Everybody's looking for change, but who will take the lead, yeah. The change that I want to see is going to start with me. Everybody's saying, Everyone that I Come on. Need, hey. I can give a smile. Smile. Everywhere I see you need, I go the extra mile. Everybody's looking for change, yeah. The change that I wanna the see. That I wanna see.
that share button. Click that share button. Invite a friend. Tell them that Pastor J, Pastor T, we're on the live. We're live. We got a word for you. Hallelujah. trying to put our two cents into it. Yes. Come on, make that declaration with us on today. Put it on the screen. Put it on your timeline yes. that God is in control. Yes. Yes. Hallelujah. He's in control. He's in control. Yes. He is in control. Woo! Oh my God. Yes. I feel something right there, Pastor T. <laughs> I'm trying to behave myself in this new year. I ain't ready. trying to cut up. It's Amen. Right. On the it's first Sunday. Right. Let Amen. God be in control. <laughs> Let the Holy Ghost be in control. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Mm. Yes, yes, God is in control. Yes, yes, mom, my God is in control. Yes, God. Hallelujah, he's in control. Woo. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's in control yes. of your finances. Yes. He's in control yes, God. over your health. Yes. He's in control. In control. Over your family, yes, God. He's, he's in control. In control. Yes, Over God. your husband or your wife, yes, God is in control. Yes, he is. Over the job situation, my yes, God, He's yes, in control. God. Yes, God. Whatever you've been standing in need of, God yes, is God. in control. He's in control of this pandemic. Yes, He is. Yes, 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 yes. Hallelujah. He's in control of the vaccine. Yeah, Hallelujah. yeah, yeah. He's yeah. in control of everything. Yeah, yeah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes, God. Yes, God. He's in control. Yes, God. He's in control of your heart. Yes, God. He's in control. Thank you, God. Father, we thank you now for this time of coming together, Lord God. On this first Sunday, Lord God, in a brand new year, thank you, God, for life, health, and strength, Lord God. Thank you, Lord God, for our minds, Lord God, that have continuously been stayed on you. Now, God, we release, Lord God, everything that would let, uh, that would cause, Lord God, us to be weighted down, Lord God, in this atmosphere of worship. We pray now, God, that you would, Lord God, speak to us, through us, Lord God, that your people, Lord God, may hear a word fresh from heaven. God, I pray right now, God, that anything that they stand in need of, God, we come and agree, touching and agreeing, Lord God, 
God, yes. that it shall be, Lord God. Yes. Father, we thank you now, Lord God, for yokes being destroyed. Yes. Lord God, for chains, fetters falling off. Yes. We thank you, Lord God, for the release, Lord God, of everything, Lord God, in heaven that has been held up, Lord God. God, we bind up the hand of the enemy now, Lord God, that will try to cause disturbance and yes. static yes. in the airwaves, Lord God. Yes. We decree and declare, Lord God, that each and every home that is watching this broadcast is blessed. Yes. Everything, Lord God, that has been trying to cause confusion, we rebuke and bind it in the name of Jesus. God, and we decree and declare peace over each and every household, Lord God. We decree and declare, Lord God, financial overflow, Lord God. Break out, Lord God, in the name of Jesus, Lord God. Why? Because you're in control. You're in control of our health. You're in control of our finances. You're in control of the pandemic. You're in control, Lord God, of the vaccine. You're in control, Lord God, of it all. And we give it all to you now. Have your way, Lord God. Touch these mortal vessels of clay, God, that we will do your will on today. Not thy will, Lord God. Not our will, but thy will be done. It's in Jesus' name. We decree it so. Amen. Hallelujah. Listen. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Amen. Hallelujah. To Kingdom Restorations Ministries 2021. Yeah, yeah, I'm excited yeah. about this year. I'm excited yeah. for what God is going to do. Listen, we got a word for you today and a good God from Zion. <laughs> Let me tell you something. This thing hit me like a ton of bricks last year. Amen. When I was in meditation and I told my wife, I said, babe, I said, listen, this is what God is saying. And she looked at me and she kind of turned her head and gave me that look like, okay, I hear you, but where you going? And when I gave her what God gave me. She said, oh, okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> but we're excited, amen, to be with you in another year. We're excited, amen, that you are in your right frame of mind, yes. good health, yes. amen, yes. that you still in the land of the living because yes. if you're yes. still in the land of the living, guess what? There's still an assignment with your name yes. on it. There's still yes. work that has to be done. There's still yes. purpose and yes. destiny that is within you that has to be birthed out of you. Yes. And I decree and declare that everything that's put inside of you shall come and be established yes. Yes. in the earth realm, Lord God, yes. in the name of Jesus. Yes. Pastor yes. T, come on and greet the Hallelujah. people. Hallelujah. I'm just excited as usual. Y'all know I get excited when we are able to fellowship but we are just coming into 2021 with so much expectation listen Let you better ask you, somebody 2020 was a year but even in that god is still on the throne yes. and so just like he was in control in 2020 we know he's in control of 2021 yes. so we just go in excited we go in speaking and declaring and decreeing what we expect god to do in not only our lives but in your lives as well we this look this is going to be a phenomenal year why because it's the year that the lord has Hallelujah. made just like it's the day that the lord has made this is the year that the lord yes, has made yes yes Hallelujah. yes 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 we Hallelujah. shall rejoice and be and glad yes. in it Hallelujah. Hallelujah. i don't know about you but i'm ready to rejoice amen for the things that god has in store for yes. you i'm rejoicing amen for yes. what he's shown me concerning you i'm rejoicing amen for the promises being fulfilled yes. i'm rejoicing rejoicing yes. for his word coming into full manifestation. Yes. I'm rejoicing yes. for I'm your breaking, yes. amen, and your healing. I'm yes. rejoicing for the signs, miracles, and wonders, yes. hallelujah, yes. that God is doing in the earth realm in this time, in this season. Hallelujah. I'm excited and I'm rejoicing yes. with yes. you. Hallelujah. Glory yes. to God. Lord have mercy. Pastor T, I'm so excited. I'm just ready to preach, but I know we got, <laughs> amen, amen, we got some things that we need to do, amen. First and foremost, amen, again, welcome, happy new year to you, your families, amen. We have missed you, yes. amen. We, we, we love you. We yes. have been in prayer for you. We've been praying for you and with you, amen, that yes. God will do, amen, exceedingly, abundantly, above all that you could ever ask or think, mm -hmm. amen, according to what? His riches. His riches, His riches. Glory. amen, oh in God. glory. <laughs> Hallelujah. I hear you, Evangelist Best. Yes. Amen, <laughs> amen. Bible study, I'm, I'm, excuse me, King them life studies yes, i'm trying to tell you yes. it, it makes a difference amen yes. so we thank god amen for you and for you being a part of what god is doing here in krm yes. listen krm we got some things that are in store amen we got some things for 2021 that god is getting ready to release us amen to do amen get ready because you're going to see a new look and a new flow amen is coming to you soon yes. amen and so 
I'm just excited, Pastor T, for this year because I believe that even in the midst of what we're going through, there are some things that God has had, amen, kept in the background, mm. in the secret place to be manifested for such a time as this. Yeah, yeah. Amen. I believe that God, amen, had some folk that he had to hide mm. and he had to put, amen, into that little corner, amen, wow. to where he had to literally oh, keep them, oh my God, I, I hope y'all can see that, covered <laughs> and shielded away, amen, from people and from things because if people or things got their hands on it, yeah. they would take what Touch God it. was doing. Yes, and God said, yes. in this hour, touch not my anointing yes. and do my prophet no harm. Yes, Why? Because God. I'm about to release something, yes. amen, in the atmosphere, in the earth realm that is going to shake the world, not yes. just the nations. It's going to shake the world. Yes, amen. God. Yes, God. Amen. We're back. Amen. We're going again. Amen. 530 a.m. in the morning with our, 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 our intercessory prayer. Amen. I'm going to ask that Pastor Talita and Minister Tiffany start this year off in prayer. Amen. Meet us. Or oh, you see the information on the screen. Meet us tomorrow morning at 530. Early in the morning while yes. I seek him. Yes. Guess what? When you can get up early and commune with God, it sets the tone for your day. Absolutely. It sets the tone for your week. And I guarantee you from the testimonies that came in from last year of how God met people. Amen. In their, in their earnest hour and in, in, in those times, amen, when they needed God, God was there to speak a word, amen, that would get them through what they were going through. So I challenge you to make it a part, amen, of your of your daily routine, but I, I, to make it a part of your routine to join us every Monday morning at 5.30 a.m., amen, 5.30 a.m., we're on. We don't hesitate. I ain't going to give you a whole bunch of fluff. I'm going to pray. Yes. Amen. We're, we're going into the throne rooms. Amen. We're going into the presence of God. Yes. Amen. To meet him there. Amen. Also, this coming Thursday at 7.30, at 7 p.m. Amen. I'm getting tongue-tied here, Pastor T. <laughs> at right. 7 p.m., our Kingdom Life Studies. We're in a dynamic study. Amen. On on. Uh, Christian discipleship, amen, and understanding our kingdom purpose and understanding who we are as kingdom citizens. It is a word that has been so intense and so uh, encouraging and enlightening and illuminating because people, amen, we get into this study and, and guess what? It's like it's like gumbo. You got Everybody got to put a little something in to make it nice, rich, and thick. So it's not something that Pastor T or myself amen, or just doing amen and just teaching and you just sitting there. No, you have to be a participant yeah. and we're not forcing you to participate, but the word will challenge you to participate yeah. because it will become engaging for you. Amen. So just be a part of that. Amen. Yeah, iron sharpens iron. Iron sharpens iron. Amen. Also, amen. Um, am I forgetting anything, Pastor T? Am I forgetting anything, Minister Tiffany? No. Amen. Amen. And also, amen. Listen, this is good ground. I told you all, amen, that the Lord had challenged me, amen, for this third Sunday of this month, amen, to be uh, our giving Sunday, our major giving Sunday, amen, where God was asking for us to sow a seed of faith. I told you what God gave me for my seed of faith, amen, because I'm, I'm leading by example of $2,500, amen, and I'm going to sow that into this ground because I'm believing God, amen, for some things, amen, supernaturally. So whatever God has laid upon your heart, amen, to sow, this is good ground to sow into. And guess what? You can't get a harvest without putting something in the ground. Yes, that's right. That's right. You can't have no potato salad if you ain't plant the potato. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you can't have no spaghetti or no ketchup or none of that if you ain't plant the tomatoes. All right now. All right. Y'all, you know, uh, some of them folk, they like corn pudding. Well, you got you to gotta put the corn kernel in the ground. That's right. You got to put the right. seed in the ground in order to get this corn stock that has ears, not just an ear, but ears, ears. of corn. Yeah, 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 yeah. See, when you plant, you reap. That's right. That's right. That's biblical. That's right. This isn't about begging for money or any of that. That's biblical. Amen. That's Amen. us challenging you to try God and hold him accountable to his word. Amen. Amen. Pray on it. Ask God what would be your seed that you would plant in faith. And when you do it, write and name your seed. Name your seed. 
you need to right now, as a matter of fact, some of you need, amen, are looking for, and, and not that it's all about the materialistic stuff, but some of you are looking for jobs, amen. Some of you are, are looking for your family to be uh, delivered and healed, amen. Some of you have lost loved ones to COVID. Some of you have lost loved ones to cancer. Some of you have lost loved ones, amen, to the, uh, uh, violence in the streets. Some of you have just lost, amen, lost, amen. And you just need your season of recovery, amen, to recover it all. Plant that seed in faith, knowing that God will meet you. Listen, the ways to give are there on the screen. You can give via Cash App. You can give via Givelify. Mm -hmm. You can give via PayPal. The information is there on the screen. And we bless God for each and every seed. Listen, if you need, if you have a specific prayer request, mm -hmm. yes. if you have a specific prayer request, and you need Pastor T and I to pray over your request, amen, to come into agreement with you over your request. The email address is there up on the screen. Yes. Email us, amen, and we will correspond with you, yes. amen. If it's, if it's something that you want to talk to us personally about, when you email us, put your... Put your phone number in there yes. and someone from our administrative staff will call you or I may even call you myself. Amen. Because sometimes I don't believe in having a whole bunch of folk and stuff. Yes. If it's something yes. that you need from God to do, I will call you personally myself. Amen. And touch and agree with you. Amen. In prayer over your requests. Why? Because I believe that when... when we come together in prayer, it moves heaven. That's right. Amen. I believe that. I strongly believe that when we come together in agreement that it moves heaven heaven. And I know because I can feel it in my spirit right now that some of you have some major things on the altar before God. My I'm God. trying to tell you right now that God is answering your prayers yes, before you can even utter them out of your mouth. You yes, just missed what I just said. Mm. I said before you can even open your mouth to speak it, it's already been answered. Yes, but God. he's waiting yes, for God. you to open up your mouth in faith, yes. knowing that he's already answered. Mm -hmm. So y'all missed the correlation. Faith without works is dead. That means there has to be some action upon your part. So if you have a request, amen, and you need us to touch and agree with you in prayer, amen, the email address is there on the screen. We will get back with you within 24 hours, amen, and we will pray, amen, amen. come into amen. agreement amen. with you. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Well, um, I think I've covered everything, Pastor T., uh, you have anything you need to add? No. Okay. No? All right. So now we're getting ready to go into our, amen, praise and worship yes. time with our very own beloved daughter, amen, Minister Tiffany Bryan. Yes. Listen, get your Bibles, get your iPads, get your your, uh, your smartphones, your tablets, whatever you have, amen. Get to 2 Corinthians chapter number 6. 2 Corinthians chapter number 6. And after praise and worship, there's a word that's going to change your life. I promise you. Hallelujah. Amen. Come on, Minister Brian, and bless us. Amen. Hallelujah. I just want to praise you forever. Forever. And ever. And ever. And ever. For all you've done.
Wow, how do you know that God has rescued your life? Hallelujah. Let me tell you something. 2020, <laughs> we made it out of 2020. <clears throat> we know that God is a rescuer. Yes, we do. And not only a physical rescuer, but a rescuer of our souls. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes, he God. is. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And guess what? We're never going back. <laughs> yes, 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 God. Never going never, back. Never, ever, ever going Hallelujah. back. Hallelujah. Yes, God. Amen. Thank you, Minister Brian. Amen. For ushering us into the throne. Amen. In praise and worship. Listen, I need for you to turn uh, and go with us to 2 Corinthians, the sixth chapter. And I, I want one verse. Uh, I need you to look at the whole chapter in its entirety. But I, I need one verse that God gave me. Um, and uh, verse number 17. And I'll be reading from the Amplified Version of the Bible. Second uh, Corinthians 6, 17, Amplified says, and I just want that A, B. It says, so come out from among unbelievers and be separate, says the Lord. And don't touch what is unclean. Stop. So come out from, un from among unbelievers and be separate, says the Lord, and do not touch what is unclean. The, the, the message Bible says it this way. So leave the corruption and compromise. Leave it for good, says God. Mm -hmm. Don't link up with those who will pollute you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So leave the corruption and compromise. Leave it for good, says God. And don't link up with those who will pollute you. Mm -hmm. uh, Pastor T, as, as, as I began to, 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 to look at this, and I, was, I began to study and, 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 and meditate on this, um, y'all know I like music. Y'all, y'all know I got an old soul, as folks say. Y'all know I like music, and and um, for those Amen of my season saints, you may remember two brothers by the name of Nile Rogers and Bernard Edwards, uh, better known across uh, the world as Sheik. And and in December of 1979, they penned a song. For the boss. Y'all know who the boss is, right? <laughs> and no, I'm not talking about Bruce Springsteen. <laughs> um, they, they, they penned a, a song for the boss, uh, Lady Sings the Blues, Miss Diana Ross, and it was simply titled, I'm Coming Out. Yes. Gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 I'm coming out, and 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 I, I need to leave with you for a theme for the day, and I'm, I'm gonna be working with this thing for a minute. I'm coming out. I, I need that to set in your spirit, and I need for you to put that on on the screen. Just type "I'm coming out" yes. because it is a a declaration. I'm I'm coming, coming out. out. Yes, God. Explanation point. I need everybody that's watching, amen, everybody that's going to watch, I need you to put that on the screen right now. I'm, I'm coming, coming out. out. Explanation point. Explanation. And, 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 and I was, I was looking at this and, 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 and that song literally started ringing in my spirit. Mm -hmm. And, and as I was looking at this and looking at the text, and, and, and hearing what God was saying, God was saying to me that we have uh, come into a new year. We've come through 2020 and we've come through all that 2020 had from, yes. from the onset of, of COVID and, 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 and the virus and, and all that it brought yes. and you know, governmental shutdowns and, and, and all of this stuff yeah. and, you know, presidential elections and manipulation and all that stuff. And God wanted me to tell you that we're coming out. Yes. Yes, God. Oh, 
Pastor T, there, 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 there is, we've come into a place and into a season, amen, where we can no longer compromise the integrity of who God has called us to be to fit in with status quo as norm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No longer can we be, amen, amen, a mm. people who who fit the mold, mm, 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 mm. Who, 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 who try to fit in and, and try, amen, to blend in <laughs> so that we could further enhance who we are yeah. and, and enhance who we're trying to be. Instead, God is saying, I'm calling you back to a place of personal integrity mm, yes. to where you get in a posture and a position to where you get into an intimate space with me mm -hmm, mm -hmm. to where all the distractions and all the noise and all the static and all that stuff mm -hmm. that has been going around and swirling around outside of you, causing you to look here, causing you to look there, looking everywhere, but looking unto me, who is the author and the finisher of your yes. faith, looking, yes. looking unto people and things and not looking at me, not in my word, not, 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 not being who I have called and ordained for you to be because you want to be the next this yes, or yes. you want to be the next that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you trying to just fit in with, with things and people. And God says that I've, I've, I've come, amen, and, and I put you, amen, in a place where no longer can you submit yourself to the religious rhetoric of 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 regular of regularity of, of things that have been regular and things that have been the calm. Norm, yeah, thank yeah, you, Pastor T. The norm. The norm. Yes, Amen. Yes, yes. Because I've called you now to where your yay has to be yay yes. and your nay has to be nay. Yes, no yes, longer yes, can yes, you yes. compromise and and straddle the fence. Yes, yes. And for too long, the church has lost yeah. its integrity and <laughs> straddled the fits when it comes to certain issues. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, we've lost our integrity, amen. We, we, we've made the church, amen. Some of us have made the church to where there's no separation from the church and from the world. When yes. you go into the church, it looks just like the world. The world. Yes, yes, and hence the, the, the shutdown. Hence us being shut up. Mm. and shut in and 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 what we i know we're in this pandemic and you have heard about this pandemic all of 2020 and you're like preacher isn't there more to this yeah there is more to this but i think we really need to understand pastor as you said that for so long the church has not looked like the church mm -hmm. And the church has embraced the things of the world instead of the world embracing the church. Mm. And so what God has had to do is say, you know what? If you can't decide to walk and to do and to be who you say you are, who yeah. you profess and confess that you are, then I'm going to allow this pandemic to come mm -hmm. to shut you up. Mm, that's so and good. to shut you in that's so because good. there's some work that needs to be done and we talked about this before the new year um came in we talked about god working on us again and that's what he's been doing if we have allowed him to do that during this pandemic because there's some things that he has not been pleased with there's some things that he has seen and he's like you know what for this next level this next era that i'm ushering the church into i need to bring them back in mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. i need to bring them back in because if i continue to allow the church to move the way it's been moving nothing won't get done because mm. if we continue to operate, our witness has been lost. Come on, sir. Come on, sir. There's no real <laughs> effectiveness of who we are because there's no separation yeah. of who we're so called to be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, yeah. we, we look like the world. We sound like the world. Yeah. We move like the world. Yes, there's yes. no oil in the place. There's no, there's no substance. And because there's no oil and no substance, the world says, I might as well stay where I am because if I see this is as the church. <laughs> 
you, I, I wrote down some notes and I said, we should be living our lives in a way that is consistent with what we believe. Mm. And the thing is, the world looks at us and say, you know what? Well, they living like they, they profess to be Christians. They claim to be this, but they live in the way we live. So we might as well keep on doing what we doing. OK, mm -hmm. let me come down your street. <laughs> let me let me let me come down your street. If, if, if they still drinking, smoking and clubbing out in the world and then you come from the club drinking and smoking. Amen. And then come up in the choir stand and you want to buck and shout and give God praise. Uh, uh, you want to go. Amen and sleep around with him, her, and everybody, amen, and then you want to come and stand in the pulpit and preach. No, on, God sir. is saying, on, it's time on. out for all of that because there needs to be a separation yes. and some integrity brought back. To, mm, yes. God yes, Almighty, yes, I feel yes, like yes, preaching. Yes, yes. There needs to be integrity yes. and wholesome brought back into yeah, the God. body of Christ. Yeah, 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 yeah. And, 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 and in the text, in the text, Paul here is, is talking to this church at Corinth. And you have to understand the dynamics of Corinth, Pastor yeah, yeah. T, because you had Greeks, you had Jews, amen. You had Gentiles, amen. And they're all, amen, uh, have been intermingled and Come intertwined on, with each other. And you're bringing various backgrounds and Come various on, ideologies and, yeah. and various lifestyles, amen. And they're all now meshed together, amen. And, and some folk were worshiping this thing and some folk were worshiping that thing and some folk, amen, were worshiping people and some folk, Come amen, on, had practices on. that were not conducive of the kingdom. And they're all mingled together. Yes, yes, yes. So that when the word comes in, mm. they don't know, mm. amen, uh, they don't know difference. the difference in how to separate it because it's been all meshed mm. together. Mm, 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 uh, mm. It's been all meshed together. Uh, yeah, uh, uh, I, I, I love, I love, mm. I love, I love, <laughs> I love Scrapple. I love Scrapple. I love Scrapple. I love Scrapple. And 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 you see my wife. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I, I love Scrapple. I I didn't like Scrapple until I became grown. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead, Pastor. I, I, I didn't like Scrapple until I came grown. Uh, but if anybody knows anything about Scrapple, uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh, a, a Scrapple is all the scraps of the pig no, that have sir. become yes, yes, and, 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 and made together and formed into a loaf to bring you, amen, a delectable delicacy yes. Uh, yes. Uh, and something real good and tasty, amen, yes. especially if you know how to cook it right, yes. if you know how to yes. season yes. it up yes. right, yes. if you know how to, amen, yes. make it to where you get the best flavor. Yes. When you season it right, yes. amen, it'll give you, oh God, the best flavor. And so now we, we, we have... God Almighty, I feel like preaching. Oh, uh, there, 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 there is a mixture of, of, of people, places, and things, amen, that have come together, amen. And because all of this stuff has meshed together, amen, you now have this one big, amen, group of people. Come on, Pastor T, because I see you jumping. I see <laughs> you jumping. Here's, here's the reason why I I now now I have in the past eaten some scrapple. Now I don't I, I didn't care for it, but this is the reason why I did not care for it. Because it is a bunch of stuff mixed together there, and mashed together. And when you can't distinguish one from the Go other, there, I have a problem with it. I need to know <laughs> what it is that I'm partaking Woo. in. Okay. Mm. Oh, God. Oh, God. My God. Here come a little know. I God. need to have a clear distinction of what I'm being a part of. I don't want a whole bunch of mess just meshed all together. <laughs> I need to know. I need to have some separation. I need to know if this is the pig is, is the pig is. If it's the ham, it's the ham. If it's the bacon, it's the bacon. I need to know what it is that I'm consuming. Come on here. I don't want to consume a whole bunch of mess and just stuff and slop. Oh my God. I, oh, I don't serve a sloppy God. Yeah, yeah, I yeah, serve yeah. a God who has given me a clear identity Identification of who I am. I serve a God yes, who is not confusing. I serve a God who is not mixed and mingled with a whole yeah. bunch of stuff. I serve a God who has sound 
doctrine and it's very clear and makes it understandable My to those who have received the word of God. That's why I don't like scrapping. <laughs> I'm with you. But, 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 I, I, I can, can I, can I take it a step further? Can I take it a step further? Sometimes I like to take my scrapple, amen, and I like to put it on some, some grits, amen. I put it on some grits and I, and I, 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 I put it, I put me a little bit of eggs with a little cheese in it, amen, Elder Dion, a little cheese in it. And, and sometimes, you know, for me, well, I get the best flavor out of it if I mix it all up together. Yes. And then some folk will look at it and be like, what in God's name are yes. you eating? And sometimes God has to put you in a place, mm. amen, where everything that has been mixed up on the inside mm. of you, yes. I got to put you now to where I can get you to clearly see, amen, the true functionality of what's on the inside mm. of you so that I can get the best flavor out of you. Oh, oh my I'm my trying my to my get my the my best my you out of you on. because you have I been mean. so mixed up and tangled up by all the doctrine that you been hearing yeah. about all the false teaching you've been getting yeah. about all this erroneous stuff that people been prophet lying over oh, your God. life and you trying to get understanding and revelation but you ain't spent no time in prayer you ain't spent yeah. no time fasting you ain't spent no time with God yeah yeah so now just all mixed so up so now Jesus so now you're in a place where My you're all God. where you're all mixed up and yes. you're all tangled up and you have all this stuff that is that is Mashed, mashed up, up. together, my God. amen, and you're sitting there, a mashed up mess, Woo, and you're trying, God. amen, to figure out why it is, amen, that you don't know up from down or back yes. from forward you're or side from sense. left. You're trying to make it make sense. Mm -hmm. uh, thank you, Minister Tiffany. You're trying to make it make sense, but you can't make sense out of you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, so, right there. So, so, in order for you. To get to the oh place. Oh my God. Jesus. In order for you to understand what's in you, he needs you now to be still, be quiet, yes. and begin to let him dissect yes. mm, and spiritually operate yes, and spiritually begin to separate the wheat yes. from the tares, yes, yes, get yes. all the noise, yes. amen, amen. I love, amen, they, they, uh, 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 AirPods came out with a new set of AirPods that they call noise cancellation mm. uh, because when you put those noise cancellation in, Pods in. Uh, it cancels out a lot of the outside noise that you can hear with the regular ear pods. Yes. Come here, somebody. Yes. God says, I'm putting you in a place where noise cancellation will become your permanent residence. Oh, uh, I'm my, putting my, you my, in a place yes, where, where you won't hear the noise, amen, yes. that has been causing confusion, yes, where God. you won't hear the noise that has been causing yes. destruction, yes. where you won't hear the noise, amen, that's been pulling you yes, God. away from God. And that, can I tell you something? Yes. That, that's the truth of the enemy. He wants to cause you to be separated. He wants you to become isolated. Yes. He wants you to become a man in a position, a man where you begin to question everything that God does. He wants you, a man, to be in a place the way you can't fully hear God and hear his instructions because if you cannot hear God, you can't fulfill the mandate. Uh, yes, you can't God. fulfill the assignment. You can't yes, walk God. in your full authority yes, and God. walk in your anointing because you're so busy, a man, listening to the noise yes. and not listening Listening yes. to the one who's speaking, amen, through the noise. Yes. And God Stop. says, if I can get you to a place where you can hear me, yes. then the noise won't matter. Yes. Oh, yes. God, if Stop. I can get yes. you to a place where you can see me, yes. oh, God, what you see with your natural eyes won't matter. Yes. Why? Because you got your eyes fixed. Yes. You know, amen, who's in control. Yes. Oh, God, help me. Peter, come here, testify. Peter began to sink when he walked on the water yes. because he took his eyes yes. off oh, Jesus. God. Yes, and began God. to look at what was going on around yes, him. God. Uh, God, when you look at what's going on around you, uh, you lose sight, amen, of what's in front of you. Yes, and when yes, you lose yes. sight of what's in front of you, oh, uh, God, you begin to sink in the midst of everything that's happening. Yes, and God. God says, in this season, for this grace, for I'm taking you in this season of your life, yes. you got to be focused yes, God. on me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hmm. Yes, so, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. so, so, Ooh, Jesus. Oh, so, so here you have this people, uh, and Paul in Second Corinthians mm -hmm. gives a more 
intimate mm -hmm. and personal mm -hmm. perspective of himself mm -hmm. as it relates to who he is and who we are in Christ. Mm -hmm. uh, Paul gives an intimate <coughs> uh, view of the kingdom mm -hmm. and how we are to govern ourselves. Yes, yes. Uh, you can't be yoked come on. in this season come on, come on. with people Things yes. that have no kingdom identity yes. or kingdom authority. Yes, yes. You can't be in this season tied down yes. in places yes. that are dead. Come on, come on. You can't be a man willing to serve in a place where you're stagnant and can't grow. Yes, Ooh, yes, yes. Yes. And the problem is we've been more committed to things than people. Mm -hmm. Then we have been committed to God. Yes, yes. And the truth of the matter is, some of us have overstayed, amen, our welcome with where we've been. Yeah. God been telling you to go, mm -hmm. and you've been too busy saying no. Mm -hmm. No, I understand something. You're loyal. Mm -hmm. You've been faithful. But this is a time and a season and a place where I need you to grow up out of, amen, who you are yes, and where you are yes, God. to come into who I've called you to become. Yes, yes, God. So, mm. so, so Paul tells them, he says, he says, there's an, there's an inconsistency <laughs> with your faith. Jesus, Jesus. Your, your faith have been compromised. <laughs> You, you, you talk a good game. Yeah, 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 yeah. You yeah, walk yeah. a good walk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But when the rubber meets the road, yeah. there's nothing that will sustain and hold you. Yeah. Because when it gets tough, mm -hmm. you begin to wobble. Yeah, yeah. You, you, you begin to lean. Yeah, yeah. You, you begin to stray and veer yeah. off yeah. course. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, Pastor T, because I, I, I see just, you jumping. I, I, just, I just heard the word perpetrator. Um, my, I just yeah, heard, that's I just good. That's good. That's good. Because at the end of the day, at the end of the day, our faith is not lining up with our walk. Mm -hmm. What we say, what we, you know, who we, who we confess to be, who we, who we tell people we are, is not lining up with what we really see. What yeah. people really see of us. We can talk a good game while we in the church house. Yeah, yeah. You know, when we surrounded by our own people, but when we get out in the streets. You know, we it, it's, it's like we become shapeshifters. We, mm -hmm. we become, oh God, I, I just saw a chameleon. We, it's, it's like some, some people become chameleons, which means you can blend into your environment. You you don't stand out. You don't, you don't stand out as the Christian you are, but you become a chameleon and you can blend into whatever environment you, you, you find yourself in. And like I said, you got to be consistent. Your confession, your profession should be walked out your lifestyle should cause conviction to the unbeliever yeah mm -hmm. not it, it shouldn't cause the unbeliever to want to call you up and say hey we know you're gonna be the life of the party and so we need you to come on out no your lifestyle your faith your how you walk should cause conviction to the unbeliever which would then turn into repentance it turns into repentance, but the problem is we 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 what we we <laughs> we can quote some Bible scriptures, but we can't live them out. Mm. You know, we can we can sing some worship songs and we can you know do all these things, but like you said, when the rubber meets the road, where's your faith? When the, when when you are confronted, you know where's your faith? Where's your word? You we 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 gotta you look. I wrote, don't fool me now. <laughs> <laughs> don't don't fool me. Don't don't fool me with your faith. Yeah. Don't fool me with who you are. You, be be who God has called you to be. Stand strong and stand proud in that thing. And Pastor T, I, I, <laughs> you said a whole lot. You you said a whole lot. <laughs> you said a whole lot. And 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 one thing that jumped out at me. And, and I need to tell this to everybody, amen, that's listening, amen, everybody, amen, that's out there. God says that he needs no more spiritual chameleons in the church. Mm, my God, my God. Oh, Jesus. There are too many shift, shape, shift, sh shape, shape shifters. Shape shifters. Thank you, Pastor T. That's all right. That was a tongue tie. <laughs> there are too many shape shifters mm. that have infiltrated the church mm. that know how to shout. <laughs> 
Everybody shit and get their dance on. <laughs> let their feet testify. Yay. Amen. And will sit back down next to you and begin to gossip and Yay. whisper. Amen. And yeah, so yeah. discord. Yeah. Amen. And before you know it, you done been yoked in and you're hearing that. Yeah. And you begin to spread and it begins to spread yeah, like yeah, yeah. wildfire across yes, the church. God. Amen. That's the problem. We've had too many spiritual chameleons. Amen. Who have come in. Amen. Looking like they. Amen. Want to be. Amen. They, they look holy. They yeah, sound yeah. holy. They yeah. know how to uh, do the do the do the church thing. Amen. But there's no true holiness in them. Amen. They, they, they've come, amen, to sow discord yeah. and confusion. Oh, and God. God said, there's no more need for the spiritual chameleon. Can I can I can I just share this, Pastor? This is this is a, a few verses. It says, Don't become partners with those who reject God. Those who reject God are the ones that come to sow discord, that sow gossip and all mm -hmm. those things like that. Mm -hmm. It says, it says, how can you make a partnership out of right and wrong? Mm -hmm. Right and wrong can't link up in the church and sit there and gossip about people. It says, that's not partnership, that's war. Mm. It says, is light best friends with dark? Does Christ go strolling with the devil? Do trust and mistrust hold hands? Come on now. We can't you you got to you got to be steadfast you, in God's word. You got to you got to stand on the truth of God's word. And when you see this darkness coming, you got to you got to let darkness know. You can't have no. I I don't have room for you. I'm not linking up with you. I don't make partnerships and pacts with anybody from the darkness. Why? Because I am a child of God. I'm a child of light. And when that stuff you know, tries to infiltrate the church, the church got to stand up. That's it. That's it. The church has to stand up. It says that's war. That's not partnership. Light and darkness can't, can't coincide with each other. That's it. It's that's war. It. And that's why, oh God, that's why some of us are dealing with war in our minds because we keep allowing darkness. We keep, you know, making uh, uh, friendships with darkness. We keep aligning ourselves with darkness. We keep going into places that are dark. Mm -hmm, you know, God mm -hmm. has called us out of the darkness mm -hmm. into his marvelous light. And we got to stand on the word of God, even if those friends don't want to stand with mm -hmm. us. Amen. So, mm -hmm. so, so are you willing to let go of those things, those people, those places who continue to be in a place of darkness mm, 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 mm. because that's where they're most comfortable mm, mm, mm. that's that's where they thrive mm. that's that's where they excel mm -hmm. and if you pull them out of their comfort zone if you pull them out of a man that particular space and place mm -hmm. they can't operate mm -hmm. because for them anything else is unfamiliar territory yeah, yeah. and God is saying I need for you now to make it a determination and a declaration <clears throat> that this shall be the year yes. that I come out of all that negative stuff yes, yes. and walk in the fullness of my kingdom anointing. Yes, that I walk in the fullness of my kingdom authority. Yes. That I walk in the fullness of all that God is calling me to. Yes, yes. Pastor, can I just share this real quick? Minister Nate, she she just put something out here that just 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 bless my spirit. She said, your faith should not be negotiable. Come on here. Your faith should not be negotiable. That means that the way my faith is set up in church is the way my faith should be set up when I walk out those church doors. That's it. It's the way my faith should be set up when I'm in the grocery store. It's the way my faith should be set up when I'm in Walmart. It's the way my faith should be set up no matter where I go. My faith is non... I, I, look, I, 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 can't, I can't pick it up. And, and, and put it on when I want to and mm -hmm. then take it off, you know, when I'm ready to cuss somebody out or, or, or you know, or, or go to the club or, or go drinking or whatever. I can't, I can't just put my faith on and off. No, my faith is sure. It's steady. It is, is rock solid. And we got to be careful. We got to be careful. Because the enemy is, he's, he's very cunning and conniving and he'll whisper some words just like he did to Eve. Surely ain't going to, you know, God ain't going to really get you for get doing this. Get out of my this. head. Get out of Surely my head. Get out of my head. Really, come on, you can just go and have a little bit of fun. Come on, you, 
Oh, Jesus. Why you keep giving me this? You, you come on. You, you, you can go ahead and sage your house to get rid of them bad energy. <laughs> <laughs> you know, no, no. Your faith has to be strong and rock solid. Mm. Because Hebrews testifies to the fact, and it says that without faith, it is impossible. impossible. It's impossible to please. It them. is impossible. Without faith, it is impossible. Yes. yes. Without faith, it is impossible. impossible. Yes, yes. To Ooh. please God. Yes, God. But to, God says I'm possible. Yeah, 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 God. Yes, God. Preaching from behind the camera. <laughs> I need for you to make this declaration. Yeah, Lord. Yes, God. 2021 is the year that I'm, mm, 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 mm. I'm coming out. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> no longer can I be hindered by the noise, by, yes. by things, by people, by circumstances. No matter, amen, what life throws at me, I will not waver, I will not falter, I will not give in, I will pass the test, yes. amen, because I will stay the course, because I am committed to what God is calling me to do, and no matter, matter of fact, when the noise comes, I'm going to be the noise cancellation. Come on. Come on, come on, when come on. you begin to talk, amen, and you begin to talk, no, no, no. If you're bringing that static over here, you need to go on and keep that to yourself. Yes, because yes, I'm trying to tell you, this noise cancellation has been turned on yes, and activated. You yes, need to God. activate your spiritual noise cancellation yes, and begin to cancel out, amen, when those voices come in the yes, middle of the night yes. and begin to speak and cause doubt, amen, fear and anxiety over your mind. Yes. You need to cancel out, amen, when, when, when the doctors give you a report saying you only got six months to live. Come and now it is six years later Hallelujah. and you're still living. Yeah, yeah, uh, you yeah. need to cancel yes, out, God. amen, when they tell you, amen, that you can't get the house, amen, because your credit, amen, is jacked up, amen. But God says that you can get, amen, what it is that I have for you yeah, because yes, I'm God. in control of the lender and the yes, finances. Yes, you can God. have whatsoever you ask, amen, if you're asking my name. Why? Because I'm canceling out, amen, all doubt. I'm canceling yes, out all fear. Yes, I'm canceling out all anxiety. I'm canceling out all that stuff yes, that will cause God. me, amen, to be in a place, amen, where I can't hear God. Yes, 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 yes. Can I just say this? This is the year where the Christian is coming out the closet. Amen. And we all coming out the closet. Listen, let me tell listen, you something. Listen. Let, me <laughs> let me tell you something. Listen, listen. That song, I'm coming out. Yeah, the, I, I know the, the, the LBGTQ I, yeah, they have taken that song as as coming out of the closet and revealing who they are and and who they you know had you know felt they had trapped within themselves. But I decree and declare that the Christian is coming out of the closet, and we will no longer be afraid to be who we are. You're gonna come out of the closet, and people are going to know beyond a shadow of a doubt that you are God's child, that you serve yes. God, that yes, you yes, no yes, longer yes, 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 serve. Yes, yes. The devil, yes, there yes, will be yes, a yes, clear yes, distinction yes, yes, of yes, your yes, identity yes, yes, yes. and who yes, you are. Yes, no God. longer will people try to look at you and figure you out. No, they're going to know when they see yes, you. Lord. Yeah, yeah. When they see you step on the scene, they're going to know, oh, there's something about this person. I see a glow on this person. And no, it's not the afterglow. No, it's the glow of the of, of, of God. It's the glow of the Holy Ghost. Yeah, You're gonna yeah. come out of the closet. Why? We even, yeah. Oh, God, we want the gays to come out the closet. Yes, God, we want lesbians to come out the closet. Why? Because we want you to get delivered and yes, set free. Yes, 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 we yes, yes, want yes, you yes, to yes. get, come on out and let us know who you are so we can come and help you to get delivered and set free. Yes. Oh, my God, we want the murderers to come out of the closet. Yes, Why? Yes. So we can get you saved. Hallelujah. We want you to come out of the closet so that we'll know what we're dealing with. So I need Jesus. you to decree and declare over your mind that my mind is coming out. Uh, that my health is coming out. Yeah, God. That, that my finances are coming out. Yeah, God. I, I, I need you to speak and decree, amen, over my family, that my family shall be whole, amen, because we are coming out. Uh, yes. I need you to speak, amen, over your job and let your job know that I'm coming out. I, I need for you to speak, amen, over your husband and your wife and yes. let you know, I'm amen, that we're coming out. Yes, we're God. coming out stronger. Yeah, I know we've had some adversity. Yeah, I know we've yes. gone through some stuff. Yeah, I know. 
that we almost lost it, lost it all, but we're coming out. Why? Because greater is he that is in us yes. than we that is in the world. Yes, and because God. he's greater and because he's on the inside yes. and because he is doing a work, we're going to come out. Amen. Yes. We're going to come out and profess that he is Lord. Yes. We're going to come out and profess, amen, that he is in control. Yes, we're going to come out and profess, amen, that we are king's kids. Yes, we're going to come out, amen, decreeing and declaring, amen, that our minds, amen, will be, amen, no longer a playground for the enemy. Yes, we're going to decree and declare, God. amen, that anxiety will not take over our health, yes, amen, God. or take over our finances. Yes, we decree God. and declare, amen, that we're coming out. out. Yes, God. And we're you're coming, coming out. out. We're coming of out. out. Hallelujah, so that God out. can give you love. We're coming Hallelujah, out. you're coming out coming of out. gossip so We're that God can allow out. your mouth to speak truth. We're coming out. You're We're coming, coming out. out of hate so that God out. can give you a little more love. You're coming, coming out. out, like he said, coming of out. anxiety and depression. Why? Coming out. So that We're God out. can give you a peace of mind. We're coming out. Hallelujah, you're coming, coming out. out. You are coming We're out. We're coming out. Whatever We're coming out. the devil has tried to keep We're coming you out. We're coming out. You are coming out. We're coming out. We're coming out. declare it over your life. We're coming Today, out. We're coming out. For tomorrow, for We're next month, for next year, that you are coming, coming out. out. And when God brings you out, you will no longer go back in. Hallelujah. We're coming out. Hallelujah. Amen. We're coming out. Amen. Of abusive relationships. Yes, We're God. coming out. Amen. Of yes, all. Yes, We're coming out. Amen. Of gossiping and backbiting. Yes, We're coming God. out of alcoholism. Yes. We're coming out of drug oh, use. God. We're coming out. Amen. Of abusive relationships. Yes, We're God. coming out. Amen. Of fornication. Yes. We're coming out of lying. We're coming yes, out of God. stealing. Yes. We're coming out. Amen. Of homosexuality. Yes, We're coming God. out. We're coming 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 out. Yes, God. 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 We're coming out. We're coming out. We're coming out. Hallelujah. We're coming out. Yes, God. Hallelujah. We're coming out. 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 And we're coming out with favor. Yeah. Yes, God. We're coming out with favor. Yes, God. Because the unclean thing. Shall no longer yes, be God. our dwelling place. Yes. The unclean thing mm, 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 mm. will no longer be the thing that entices us yes. to pull us back into a place yes. of familiarity. Yes, God. Uh, because the enemy wants to pull you back to that thing that's familiar. Yes. Because it's something that you can relate to. Yes, God. It's something that's comfortable. Yes. But I decree and declare. That this is your year yes. of coming out. Yes, God. You're coming out of all the naysayers. Yes. You're coming out, amen, <laughs> of all those that have spoken against you. Yes. You're coming out, amen. Oh, God, Come you're coming on, out yes. and coming into yes. all the abundance yes. Yes. of heaven. Yes. And there's so much more. Yes. That God has in store for yes, you. Yes, God. There's so much more yes, God. that God wants you to see. Yes, There's God. so much more. So much more that God wants you to experience. Yes, Lord. There's so much more that He has in store for you. Yes. But God. you gotta come out. Come out. You gotta come out. Come out. You 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 gotta come out. Yes. Lord have mercy. Yes, you, yes, you, you, you gotta come yes, out. I, I, I matter of fact, I need you to go and pull up the words. Yes. It says, I'm coming out. Yes. I want the world to know. Yes. I've got to let it show. Yes. I'm coming out. Yes. I want the world to know. I've got to let it show. Yes. There's a new me coming out. Yes, God. And I've just got to live and, and I want to give. Yes. I'm completely positive. positive. Yes. I, I think this time around, I'm going to do it like I never do it. Yes. Uh, like I never knew it. Yes. Oh, I'm going to make it through. Yeah, 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 Why? Yeah. Because this time has come for me to break out of the shell. Yes. I've got to shout yes. that I'm coming out. coming out. Yes, God. God Almighty, I need for you to come out yes. of that place. Yes, God. That has held you bound yes, God. for so many years. There has yes, God. Oh God, I speak now to every person who has been wrestling, Lord God, for years. Yes, Lord. Ooh, with the spirit of depression that has been plaguing, Lord God, their family, Lord God, from generation upon generation. Yes. God. Lord God, they have been wrestling, Lord God, with their mind, their double-mindedness, yes, Lord God. Jesus. They get two steps forward and be 
assured of what it is that they're doing, but all it takes is a little wind of doubt or gossip to come that will make them begin to think uh, uh, in a negative light. Yes, Jesus. God, we, we, we cancel that, God. In the name of Jesus. In the name of yes, Jesus. God. God, we cancel, Lord God, the spirit of fear. Yes, in Lord. the name of Jesus. In the name of we Jesus. cancel, Lord God. Yes, God. Ooh, all sickness and distress. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. God, we're coming out and we're coming out ahead. Yeah, God. We're coming out on top. Yes, God. We're coming out, Lord God, of that place, Lord God, that has been holding us bound for so many years. Yes, Jesus. God, we speak now and decree, Lord God, that we will live and dwell in a healthy place. Yes, God. Lord God, Lord from Jesus. this day forward, Lord yes, God, we shall no longer, Lord God, be with the familiar place, yes, Lord. but we'll walk in the supernatural place yes, and dwell in the abundance yes, of God. all that you have for us. Yes, Lord. God, we thank you and we love you yes, God. in the name of Jesus. Yes, God. It is so. Yeah, Can you just type that on the screen, please? I need each and every person to type that on the screen. I'm coming out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 2021 is my year. I'm coming mm -hmm. out. I need for you to type that and make that your declaration, make that your mantra yes. that I'm coming out. Yes. Whatever it is that you need God to do, whatever it is, amen, that you have been dealing with, know that you are coming out. Yes. You can't get to where God wants you to be, amen, staying stuck back where you were. Yes. God says that is no longer the place and well you reside. Yes. Uh, you no longer <laughs> reside in that place. I'm I'm calling you to another level of oh, glory. Yeah, I'm calling you God. into a different dispensation of my grace. I'm calling you into a different anointing mm -hmm. and you have to come out from the familiar and come into the unfamiliar and, and flow in the supernatural. Yes, God yes. Almighty, I need yes. you to put that on the screen. I'm coming out. I'm coming out. I'm, uh, I'm coming out. I'm coming, I'm coming out. out. I'm, coming out. I'm coming out all week long. I need you to decree and declare that I'm coming out. I'm Whatever coming you're coming out of, you need to make sure that you write it. Get yes. you a journal. Yeah, yeah, Get yeah, you a yeah, journal and down. begin to write, write down. down. Amen. Write Everything down. that you need yes. to come out of whatever. Yes, drinking, God. lying, smoking. Yes. Amen. Sex, Death. fornication, debt. Yes. Amen. You need to decree and declare that yes. I am coming, coming out. out. Yes, Why? God. Because I believe that in this hour, God is propelling, amen, us into a portal, amen, of supernatural favor. Yes, He's God. put us yes, into a, a dispensation of grace, amen, where the heavens are open and the oil is being poured. Yes, now, what God. will you do? Do. Will yes. you stay stuck and bound, or will you make your declaration that I am I'm coming out. out? Yes, God. Hallelujah. 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 I'm coming out. Hallelujah. I'm coming out. 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 Yes, God. I'm coming out. Yes, God. I'm coming out. I'm coming out. Some of y'all saved and can't handle this. Ah. Some of y'all saved and can't handle this. I dare you to get up and kick the door down like Mr. Matei said. Listen. Take your foot and just bust the I door. I dare you. Just bust it I dare you to. I dare you to make this mantra. Kick the devil out the way. And let him know that you're coming out. Yes. Yes, God. I dare you to let the world know that you're coming out. And you're a Christian and you're going to stay out. Listen. I can't yes, stay in God. that familiar place no more. Because that familiar place will keep me bound. Yes. That familiar place will keep me trapped. Yes. You need to make sure yeah, yeah, yeah. that you come out. Yes. And yes. when you come out, you stay, stay out. out. Hallelujah. Yeah. Yeah, come stay out, out and stay out. Hallelujah. Don't go back into that closet, into that darkness. Don't hide your light. Let your light shine so that men may see. Hallelujah. That, that, that we serve an awesome, a, a glorious God. Yes, God. Hallelujah. I'm coming out. I'm, yes. com I'm, I'm, I'm coming yes. out. Yes. I'm, I'm coming out. Yes. I'm coming out. I've got to shout. That's right, Nate. Rip it off the, rip the door off the hinges. I'm coming I'm out. Coming out. Rip the door I'm off the hinges. I'm coming out. I'm got to let the Christ show. Yeah. I'm coming out. That's right, Elder Dion. Dance, yes. dance, dance. Let them know I'm yes. coming out. Yes, That's God. right, Monica Smith. Coming out yes. and staying out. That's right. I'm coming out. Coming out. I'm coming out. Yeah, That's right, the Diamond. Yeah. I want the world to know. I want the world to know. I want the world to know that I'm, I'm not, coming out. Yeah, I'm not I ashamed. I want the world to know that Christ is pulling me Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
yeah, yeah, yeah. No longer yeah, 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 yeah. to say I'm a Christian. Come on here, Ariana. God. Yes, God. Dance, Ariana. Dance, yes, Ariana. God. Dance, Dance Ariana. Dance your way out. Yes, God. Dance your way out. Yes, Let God. your feet testify. Yes, God. Come on here. Let the world know that I'm out. Yes, Come God. on here. Let the world know that I'm out. Yes, God. My God. I thank you, God. Y'all yeah. weren't ready for this today. <laughs> I tried to tell you. Yeah, 2021. Yeah. God is doing some new things. Yes, God. And y'all out. <laughs> y'all free. Yeah. You better live in the abundance yes, of what God. he's trying to do. Because yeah. if not, you're going to be left behind. Yes, God. Shoot. Come on here, Nikki. Dance. Yes, tell him God. I'm coming out. Dance. Dance. Tell him I'm coming out and I'm staying out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Turn that up, Tim. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. I'm coming out and I'm staying out. Yeah. I'm coming out and I done slammed the door behind me. Yeah, I got the lock and key. I done, Lord, Lord have mercy, I done welded the door shut. Yeah. Yes, sir. I done welded the door shut. Yes, sir. So I ain't even got to worry about it. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, sir. <laughs> ah, so you can't go back in my past yeah, and yeah, yeah, some yeah. stuff. Because, because the door is well shut. shut. Yes. <laughs> yes, God. I'm coming out. 2021, you can't listen. 2021 ain't ready for what God got. Because I'm coming out. I'm coming out in full authority. I'm Yay. coming out with full power. I'm coming out, amen, with everything that God has for me. Yes, I'm coming sir. out. Yes, I'm coming sir. out. I'm coming out. I'm yes, coming sir. out. I'm coming 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 out. Yes, I'm coming out. I'm coming with everything he's promised me. Yay. I'm coming out. Yeah. I'm coming out with all power. Yay. I'm coming out with all authority. Yay. I'm coming out with new insight. Yay. I'm coming out with new understanding. Come I'm coming on. out. <laughs> Amen. Yeah. Yes, yes, oh, yes. Hey. Come, come on, Neil Come on, Pastor. Come on, Pastor. I'm coming. Oh, hey, listen. Oh, God. Y'all ain't ready. Y'all ain't ready. <laughs> Y'all ain't, yes, ain't ready, y'all ain't ready, y'all ain't yes, ready, y'all ain't ready, y'all ain't ready, y'all ain't ready, y'all ain't ready. Yes, ain't ready. I, listen, Woo. listen, I'm coming out. Yes, God. Yes, Lord. Woo. And I'm going to expose every lie that the devil tried to tell to keep me bound. Because guess what? If I hold it, it's going to keep me trapped. Yes. So I'm coming out with a free mind. Yes. I'm coming out, amen, ain't, listen, everything that was on my shoulder is all is going to the side Come now. Because I'm coming out, baby. Yes, Hallelujah. Woo. Look, Jesus. Look. Woo. My past ain't going to hold me trapped no more. Woo, what I did in my past can't hold me trapped no more. I tell it before anybody else tell it. And that's the problem. Too many folks trying to tell your business. I can tell you. No, know, you better. tell your own business. Woo! Why? Because I'm free, so I can tell you. That's it. That's it. Yeah, they try to it. hold you trapped by your by your past. Yeah. yeah, I did it. I did it. I was big and bad when I did, did it. Very well. But guess what? Hey! I came out, hey. baby! And I'm and free! I'm Whom the hey. sun set free hey. is free hey. indeed! Hey. Come on out! I'm out now. 